Good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video. Today we are going to take a close look at the Golden Doodle. Before we begin, please remember to like and share our video if you find it useful. Please subscribe to receive notifications when we publish new dog-related content. Golden Doodle, Golden Retriever and Poodle were crossed to create the designer dog known as the Golden Doodle. In 1969, Monica Dickens, great-granddaughter of Charles Dickens, is widely credited for creating this new type of poodle mix back. The original purpose of the cross was to create guide dogs suitable for visually impaired individual with allergies. This designer mix was created to combine the non-shedding coat of the poodle with the desirable temperament of the golden retriever. As always, the pros are up first, excellent for allergies, they would be a fantastic choice if you were looking for an allergy-friendly pet. Cuddle lovers, do you desire a snuggle-loving pet? Golden Doodles enjoy cuddle up with their owners. Playful, they have outgoing, pleasant, and adventurous attitudes and enjoy playing with their family members. They are known for being sociable dogs that usually get along with other canines and people. Golden Doodles score 5 fifths as apartment-friendly dog breeds. Different sizes, miniature doodles can weigh up to 20 pounds and are suitable for apartments. Intelligent. Golden Doodles usually inherit the Poodle's intellect and are a brainy pet to have. Longevity, they have a relatively long lifespan of up to 16 years and even longer in some cases. Now it's time for some cons, workout needs, Doodles need to exercise frequently. If you aren't up for that kind of effort, it can be a little difficult. Separation anxiety, any dog who is left alone at home may develop this chronic canine illness. Stubborn, although very intelligent, they can be independent thinkers who prefer to go their own way. Expensive, you might want to reconsider purchasing Doodle if you're worried about your financial situation. Grooming, despite the fact that they don't shed, Golden Doodles need a lot of grooming. Expensive, this hybrid breed can cost anywhere from £1,000 to £10,000 depending on their height, color, and training. Interesting facts, there are four generations or versions of Doodle. One. F1, Golden Retriever X Poodle. 2. F1B, Golden Doodle, F1, X Poodle and most allergy-friendly classification. 3. F2, Golden Doodle, F1, X Golden Doodle, F1. 4. F2B, Golden Doodle, F1, X Golden Doodle, F1B. These dogs don't need a celebrity to be famous and meet Samson the Doodle with more than a 1 million Instagram fans. Perez Hilton, Usher, Jensen Ackles, and Kenny Chesney are among other famous people who own Doodle. Appearance, Doodles come in a lot of sizes which can be a standard, mini and large size. The standard average size of Doodle is about 13 to 20 inches and weighs 15 to 35 pounds. A mini doodle is about 17 to 20 inches and large one is about 20 to 24 inches. The mini one weighs 40 to 50 pounds while the large one weighs 50 to 90 pounds. They have a wide variety of coat colors include black, white, copper, cream, apricot, golden, and or red. The average lifespan for a doodle is 10 to 14 years. Grooming, take your doodle in for grooming at least once every 6 to 8 weeks if you desire shorter hair. If you want longer hair, schedule a visit every 8 to 10 weeks. Occasional baths will be beneficial because regular baths dry out the skin. Regular tooth brushing and occasional nail trimming are recommended. Clean the ears as they are vulnerable to infections because of their drooping nature. Shedding, some golden doodles do shed, some do not. They cannot be regarded as completely non-shedding because they have DNA from both a shedding breed, golden retriever and one non-shedding breed, Poodle. Curly coat, wavy coat doodles typically do not shed and straight coat doodles will likely shed. F1 doodles can shed, depending on coat type. F2 doodles are less likely to shed due to selective breeding. F1 BS are less likely to shed due to the higher proportion of Poodle genetics. Shedding your puppy will experience is largely dependent on what generation they are and the genetics of their parents. Cost. On average a doodle puppy will cost $2,000 in the USA and most puppies can be found between $1,200 and $3,200. First year expenses are around $5,675 and will be about $2,250 per year, 
or $188 month. Throughout the course of its lifespan, the average cost of owning a Doodle is $32,675. The average price for a standard Doodle is $1,500, a mini Doodle average price is closer to $2,900. The price of Doodles in India is between $30,000 to $80,000 and show quality breed can go up to lakhs of rupees. Exercise and trainability, because of their energetic personalities, these dogs do need regular and consistent exercise. They will need to exercise for at least 20 to 30 minutes per day, which will keep them from getting bored. Training a doodle is quite simple. It won't take much of your time and work, which will make anyone who has never owned a dog happy. These canines are smart and quick to take up commands. Training your dog may be a joyful experience with a good attitude and positive reinforcement. Unleashing the dog in public area and leave them alone in unfenced area should be restricted. Intelligence. Doodles are very smart as they are very perceptive of their environment and the feelings of those around them. They quickly pick up commands and have an amazing capacity to interact with their owners. Swimming. Doodles can swim, but it might take a little loving encouragement from you in the beginning. They enjoy the ocean, lakes, rivers, beaches and in your backyard swimming pool. All sizes of doodle can swim. Swimming is a skill that can be difficult and intimidating for your doodle to learn at first. The endurance and time that a miniature, toy or teacup doodle can swim is lesser than larger dogs. Barking. Not all doodles bark, although many do. Some only bark when they are in public due to excitement. Others bark all the time. There is no predisposition to the breed, it differs from dog to dog. Several owners claim that their quiet personality is what makes them such good indoor dogs. One doodle might like to bark, while another might be quiet, non-vocal personality. Mini doodles are boisterous, loud dogs. They react to everything with a loud bark, whether excitement, boredom, fear, and outside sounds. Weather and climate. Doodles generally tolerate hot weather quite well but, like most dogs they can still develop heat stroke without much warning. A healthy doodle enjoys a routine walk when the temps is up to about 85 degrees Fahrenheit 30 degrees Celsius, but it's crucial to limit your pet's activity during the hottest part of the day. Although most doodles enjoy playing in the snow, they aren't a breed for cold climates. This means that doodles shouldn't spend a lot of time outside in the winter, unlike dog bred for the cold like huskies. If the temp drops under 20 degrees Fahrenheit, you should get your doodle inside to keep them warm. Friendliness. Doodles are good with babies and get children of all ages since they are clever, sweet-natured, and loving dogs. These dogs can keep up with the quick pace of households with children because of their high levels of energy. Doodles can be aggressive towards other dogs. There is nothing about their breed that makes them any more likely to have dog aggression than any other breed. Instead, they tend to be gentler and more sociable than some other breeds, but even a doodle may develop some aggression issues depending on their exact situation and history. Doodles are genetically coded to be good with other pets such as cats because golden retrievers and poodles have a low prey drive. They are usually friendly to strangers, and they are not known for reactive behavior. Although they aren't usually guard dogs, they may bark to warn their family of an approaching stranger. Adaptability. Doodle is the best breed of dog for apartments, especially if you decide against getting a puppy. They rarely bark, which is advantageous for apartment residents with surrounding neighbors. Doodles are a fantastic breed option for first-time dog owners. They are perfect for anyone with little to no experience raising puppies due to their temperament, friendliness, and trainability. Doodles often have separation anxiety and don't do well when left on their own. An adult doodle may be left alone for 5 to 9 hours when properly trained for alone time. Guard slash watchdog. Doodles do not make good guard dogs, but they do make good watchdogs. They will keep you informed of any guests or trespassers, but they won't defend you. Have you had any experience with Golden Doodle? In the comment section below, we'd love to hear your story. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the future video.